Good morning, YouTubies. Happy Gregorian New Year. I am about to fix my face, put in my eyeballs because I can't see, and not put in my eyeballs, put in my eyes, my contacts. And I'm going to let the hair down. I straightened my hair last night. You know that was um, hours process, but I'm trying to straighten it more just to change it up a little bit. Aurora. Aurora, what do you have to say about all this? You started your day already, didn't you? Aurora? Hey, you guys. This is turning into an unintentional vlog. So, I wiped my face with these um, Burt's Bees. These are like, they're godsend. Especially after you just spent hours straightening your hair. I'm just saying, I'm just saying. So, um... Cleanse the face, brush the teeth. I have my contacts in. I'm about to get a nice glass of coconut water and brew up some coffee and have a quick devotional, read some word. Um, I want to start the day right. And when I don't start with the word of God, it's like the day could have been better. It was a good day, but it could have been better, you know? <laughs> I didn't want this video to be super, super long. I'm sorry, but I'm going to show you what I got from Trader Joe's. And I was intending to, like I said, announce a fitness challenge that I wanted to do for January because this is, this is one, one. Okay. This is January one. And I know a lot of people are thinking about health or thinking about fitness. And I'm passionate about that to the degree that I want people to have access to what they need to have access to for free, preferably, um, even though nothing is free. I'm giving of you my time and that's why it's really important for you to like, for you to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos from me because this is a lot of my time. I'm sacrificing time that I could be spending with my family recording this for you and it's, it's important, just getting texts here, you know what I'm saying? First week is going to be home workouts, workouts that you can do from home. Week two are going to be gym workouts, okay? Workouts that, that when I go to the gym, this is what I do. i um, doing it on the end of weightlifting and cardio because that's basically what I do when I, when I go to the gym. Um, and also, uh, I forgot what week three, what is week three? I forgot. We'll, we'll get there. We'll get there when we get there. But I wanted to do something that's quick that's going to get you get your get your workout in and not take a whole lot of time and you can do that with with at home weights body weight without buying these expensive machines these expensive gadgets that do they really work um yeah and of course i gotta talk about diet because that's kind of they come along with me and my journey because one thing that I would say as a weakness is diet for me. I have what people call high metabolism. It's actually called resting metabolic rate, which means that my metabolism is working around the clock, whereas someone else's, because metabolism is metabolism, but metabolism does what it does, regardless of 
there's no such thing as like my metabolism, my metabolism works faster than yours. It's just that some people's metabolism, like when you eat, you're, there, there are certain things that happen in your body um, that's called, that's what metabolism is. And so the breakdown of, of your food into things that your body can use. And, and from what I understand anyway, is that some people's bodies continue to do that. Like throughout the day, you get a, you, you get a little praise dance in this, in this video too. You didn't know, you didn't know. Uh, but yeah, so regardless of that, because of that, I'm saying is that I feel like my diet has been subpar. I enjoy shopping at places like Trader Joe's. I enjoy shopping for organic. Um, but my main thing is just to be healthy. Um, that means more fruits, more veggies, more things. If I, if I can eat raw, I'll eat things raw. Does that mean I want to become a raw vegan? No. I ran out of space, so my camera died. And it's so frustrating because half of that I'm probably going to edit out. But anyway, um, I'm going to show you what I got from Trader Joe's. Okay, you guys. So my Trader Joe's haul here, I got, um, I always get some organic carrot juice. I just do. And I usually drink it then, but because we were going to Foco de Chao, a Brazilian uh, grill place, um, I had some, I got focus. Mm -hmm. I got some kombucha because um, I needed the probiotics. It's not gonna focus, but you know what I'm saying? Okay. Um, and I got some soy slices. I'm trying to reduce my dairy. I'm not eliminating dairy, but I wanna reduce it. So I do wanna give these cheese alternatives a try. It's 99% lactose free, just now seeing that, but hey, that's better than, you know, 1% lactose free. I mean, right? So the spinach tortellini, which this is already open. If you uh, watch me on Instagram, you'll see the meal that if you watch me on it, if you follow me on Instagram, if, <laughs> if you follow me on Instagram, you'll see the meal that I, I, I was hungry at last night. I was trying to save this for the haul, but I just took it all back out because I actually went to Trader Joe's two days ago. This wasn't out on the table, obviously for two days. I mean, obviously I just filmed and this wasn't here, but anyway, wild blueberries i was like what because you know wild bl blueberries are better for you than um not wild you know these are frozen love frozen veggies this is going to be on um oatmeal um smoothies i also got this organic mixed berry blend from trader joe's um not bad price i think these were like 240 a, a piece which is, is well, wait a minute these were two dollars this one might have been like a dollar 79 a bag which is not that bad um you know what i'm saying i got two of those and two of these and speaking of oatmeal that's gonna be one of my main breakfasts because it's easy it's healthy it's full of nutrition and if you're going to the gym you need some oatmeal so these candied pecans i like topping my uh my oatmeal with nuts um specifically nuts that are you know lightly sweetened got a little got a little bit of something something to it i also wanted to try this um it's like a mushroom powder um i've heard of people adding this to like burgers and i plan on making my own burgers if i have any this year it will be homemade as opposed to going to five guys i'm not saying i won't ever go to five guys but you got to make goals you got to make goals okay um i also got some coconut water that you saw me drinking earlier um, I got, I, tr I want to try this. It's a whole wheat, um, it's a whole, what's it called? Whole, is it gonna, whole, oh, ready to bake whole wheat pizza dough. Just want to give it a try. Um, and let's see, is that V? Sorry, is that V for vegan? I don't know. Um, and I think that's so cute on there. They have Trader Giatos. <laughs> they have it on this one, too. I just think that's cute. I'm crazy. OK, um, I got some habanero lime flour tortillas. Um, never tried those. They look delicious. So want to try those, make some fish tacos, have some 
breakfast omelets, um, breakfast burritos. Let's get it right. Um, I also got some organic sprouted seven grain brand, bread. I heard that sprouted bread is better for you. I had been using, um, I tried Ezekiel bread. I like it. Um, I just, because it just goes bad fast and I don't really have bread a lot. So, you know, even refrigerated, it just, I, I just feel bad getting it cause I feel like I'm going to waste it. So hopefully I'm going to go ahead and pop this back in the freezer and hopefully can use, take out some and freeze the rest. That's probably what I need to do cause I'm not a big toast person in the morning. Um, I also got, uh, some vegetable fried rice, like frozen, just it's just vegetables, fried rice. I can add chicken if I want to, or I can have it on a meatless Monday, you know? Um, I got some red split lentils. This is actually for my Ethiopian friend because she makes, I don't know if you've ever had Ethiopian food. If you haven't, you're missing out on life. I got a cheese pizza, gluten-free cauliflower crust, crust also for, for, I think I'm gonna try this out on next Monday for my meatless Monday. It will be this cheese pizza. Um, I also got some cereal because Mama said, you know, you should have some cereal around your house just in case. Not a big cereal eater, especially when it's cold. The non-food item I got was uh, this, this, you know what it is. It's the Trader Joe's Lord. This thing doesn't want to focus. Hello, focus baby, it's okay. Um, there we go. There we go. Trader Joe's Tea Tree Tangle Conditioner. I use this a lot when I wear my hair curly. So that was a must. I think that that was everything. Um, thank you so much for watching. I will be posting, like I said, on Instagram, the meals that I do make. And I almost forgot the matcha green tea latte. How could I forget that?